Yo what's up guys and welcome back to a brand new video here on my channel. In today's video I'm going to show you how to boost your FPS and significantly lower your input delay with this one tool now, so make sure hit that subscribe button let's dive into the video. Gear Up Booster is one of the best programs for the optimization of your ping while you play games using your wired or wireless connection, so get this paid program free from my description and play your game with lower ping. First go to my website I give link in description. Download the FS Boost pack from here and follow me for settings. You will be greeted with all these tweaks, but if you're opening for the first like time, like most of you guys will be, you will be greeted with like, you know you might have to sign in immediately. And once you signed in after opening it, it will give you a message saying it's not guaranteed that your performance will be boosted, which is like I said in an intro, that it varies from computer to computer, is different from every computer, but it should work for most of you guys, like I said. And once you've done that, you will be greeted with all this. Now what I recommend doing before anything is coming up here where it says system restore, and impressing create system restore naming. Do anything like up for instance. I'll name it to side for this video. I cannot spell. Alright so like that. Just pretty simple. Straightforward. And once it's finished um. You can go back to right here. To the home and go back to these optimizations. Now basically. This program provides you with a description. For every tweak here. So you know like what it does and what it can do and even says power hungry which is important for laptops because it will increase your gp temperature if you have more power coming from your computer and i don't recommend this option for laptop players by the way because this is power thought link and you guys need power thought link because temperatures are bad on laptop and it will break your component so i don't recommend turning this off but other than that the rest of these are really good like such as game gaming optimizations optimize windows time resolution this makes your delay significantly less it is really good. Um, even have disable Cortana. All of these and. I want you guys to keep in mind that you guys will be having limited tweaks if you're on a free version. The paid version is like $6 a month. It's not that much, but it's worth it. As you see, I have all the tweaks that are pretty good using right now. I'm using them right and now. And it's really good. Like my computer feels smooth. Like silky smooth right now. Just showing you guys this. But I do recommend you guys. Pay $6 a month for the premium because you will be able to get as much sweets as possible from this program and it's, it's really worth it. Like I literally played Fortnite after enabling these weeks and my delay was significantly less and my FPS was better and it felt way smoother. I can do more stuff in the game, so I do recommend you guys pay for the premium. But if you do have like the limited and you can pay for the premium, the ones that I would tell you that you should enable the most is, um, let's see. If you guys need to optimize your in video or AMD, it's even CD. for AMD too. You know, optimize the settings for you. Um, so if you guys need that, I do recommend putting optimize AMD settings right here. And if you're on Nvidia, do the same thing for Nvidia. So option right here, general optimizations or the I think they have like a another one to here somewhere. I just can't find it, but yeah, it is really good, and I do recommend using it. Um. The most tweets you should use like I said, those are the two. And then you should use maybe optimize power plan and disable hibernation, stuff like that and optimize IO operations. Just just read through all of these and see what benefits the most basically and just put them on if you're on free version. But if you're on the paid one, I recommend doing as much as you can after reading all of them. But it does significantly lower input delay. It is really good. Like my computers feel so smooth. Just moving my mouse right now. And also there's another option right here. Next to optimization. If you go to boost up. There's more options such as junk cleaner. Optimize defrag drives. Stuff like that. It is really good to run in your computer. Cause you do need it. Um junk cleaner will really. Significantly improve your delay. Optimize defrag drives is really good too. This will make your drive run faster. And smoothly when you play games. And it even says right here the description of it just like how the other tweaks did and these are really good um i do recommend doing all of these because these do it will it could actually really benefit you if you're on low and it would really benefit your fps a lot so i do recommend doing all of these um after doing the other tweaks of course right here after doing them but they also got a section right here where it says game settings now this is very important because this will optimize your you know just if you leave it right here like just press activate it will really optimize your game settings like it'll make your game settings really good 
It will boost your FPS basically and give you the most performance you can get out of the game, which is what you want. And it will significantly you know. Lower input delay to while doing that. But um yeah, that's pretty much it. And if you guys have any issues with these tweaks, you can always you know. That's why I told you create a restart point right At first right here. you can just go back. Click the one you made, the newest one, and basically you'll just go back. Well not from here, but if you don't know how to go up. If you guys don't know how to go to your restart point, just go to your search bar. Press create restore point right here. You go to system restore. Press next and you click on the newest one that you made from the program. And you press next and then. Yo and restore your things. If it messes up anything after the tweaks, but it really shouldn't. It should benefit most of you guys. Especially low in PC players. This program is really good. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you guys hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell for more videos. I will be putting out more tweaks very soon. So make sure you guys stay tuned. I will be posting tweaks a lot on my channel. So if you guys, you know enjoy tweaks and stuff, make sure you subscribe for that reason. Hit the notification bell. But um yeah, peace out.